Okay, guys, I'm gonna be totally straight up with you. I just ate two to three bananas, so this video might get a little wild. Also, Inaho has this house, apparently. That's cool, and... Am I gonna have to pay homeowner insurance now? Uh, maybe. I don't know how Japan works. <laughs> I actually don't. I mean, I assume so. And yes, yes, you have to pay the taxes, or the government will go under. Hmm, I don't care about the government. Oh. But you're gonna have to change that attitude right now, Missy! And, oh my gosh, someone rung the doorbell. It's the CIA! Wait, does the Japan have CIA? I don't care. Let's open the door and get audited. Yeah! <laughs> I don't know what that's, that's how that works. Anyways, chapter four. Come and get the door! Slam jam, thank you. Uh, I can't rap. Why'd I even try? Um, I'm sure it's really interesting and all, but I honestly just want to get started on Nate's story because we're gonna get so many freaking yokai in this episode. You guys aren't even prepared. Yes, Inaho, glasses are for your face. Everyone knows this. Even Mr. Goodsight, he even has a glass thing. Is the singular of glasses glass? Like, how, how does that how does that work? Now, glasses is pure, pure. Okay, also, Wafer can give us quests. Yeah, that's cool. All right, I'm peacing out. But yeah, we're going back to Nate because Nate needs to go to the circus. Also, oh my gosh, it's Mirapo. <sighs> I love Mirapo. It's so sticking much. Are you going to explain how Mirapos work? Donnie is thinking. Okay. When did we get Mirapo and Yokai Watch? I swear, it was like at the very end of the game, and I hated that. Because it's such a good feature. We should have got like chat, like chapter four, literally. And now we got it. So that's cool and stuff. Okay, cool. I, I, Mirapo, you're beautiful. Also, we can, we can teleport to our uh, detective agency, I guess. Because <laughs> I named it uh, Star Star Music, you know, for some stinking reason. Anyway, screw you guys. I'm going home. Just kidding. I'm going to Nate's story, which in a sense is my home. Because I live in America. If you didn't know by my southern accent. <laughs> Anyways, back to what we were supposed to be doing. We're supposed to be meeting Na M Knack. <laughs> yes, my best friend is a PlayStation 4 exclusive. No, we're meeting Mac at the circus, so let's get there. Hey, what up, man? Hey. Hey. Yourself. I always hated that, that like, phrase. It's like, hey, yourself. It's like, dude, screw you, man. Why are you making fun of me? Anyways, this is the circus. And as you can imagine, that clown is depressed because he's at the circ. Not really. And whoa, this place looks awfully weird. Yeah, it's pretty run down, but it's still kind of cool. That's heavily debatable. Ah, uh, why do you guys always gonna hate all my stuff? Anyways, yeah, the circus is pretty rad, but crap, we need tickets. Yeah, where are we gonna get them? Uh, I hope he's not doing anything illegal. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should go check on him. That'd be for the best, and uh... I can't believe it, Rebecca! What can't you believe? Wait, the same person talking, and... Uh, you know what, Tracy? Honestly, I'm thinking about quitting the circus. I could be a fashion model. I really can, don't you think? I'm gonna do it. Tomorrow, I'm gonna do it. What, really? I mean... You trained your whole life to be in this world famous circus, and you're just gonna be a fashion model? Why not? Fashion is that much closer to showbiz, but, but isn't a performing art slightly. Uh... Alright. I, I John, I doubt that's what they're saying. Don't break the fourth wall, Nate. That's rude. <laughs> oh, no! There must be yokai afoot! That's the only explanation for anyone's problems. I mean, can't people just cause their own problems? No, it's gotta be a yokai, and yeah. Oh my gosh, I see it. I never even see That's so creepy, look at him. Oh my gosh, he's absolutely disgusting. Oh my gosh, he's actually beautiful. Eh, I don't know about that. <laughs> and wait, this guy's depressed over his bike. That must be yokai's fault. Dude, I swear, think about Nate's life in general. Every, like, video game protagonist is like, Yes! Finally my chance to save the world! Nate's just like, Man, I don't wanna do this bullcrap. Anyways, in a previous episode, I was kinda getting mad at the quest function in this game, but... To be totally honest, it is heavily revamped from Yokai Watch 1, and I actually like it now that I've had a bit more time to play around with it. But basically, this segment, we need to do three miscellaneous tasks involving Yokai. And can I just say that one looks absolutely terrifying. Now, since you are playing in, in, in not Japanese, some of these are hard. 
Some of these are really easy. So I'm going to show you the really easy ones that you really don't need English to complete. Well, I guess I should say Japanese to uh, complete. And... Wow, that frame rate on those balls. Okay, that's kind of weird, but uh, Max just chilling at the brochures apparently. But no, there are a couple of these that are super simple to knock out. And what's going on here? I don't know about you, bro, but I think this guy's like a reverse Super Saiyan because he's like purple and you know he's kind of reminds me of Frieza. Frieza? Wait. Like, from Dragon Ball, yeah, from that, and, well, this guy's got, like, the same shirt I do, what the heck? That's stinking weird. I'm not talking about me, I'm talking about, like, Nate, what the heck, and, uh, oh, okay. That is Hatu Cakes. Th this is the easiest quest ever, and I'm gonna try and, like, finish all of these in this episode, by the way. Because it is kind of a daunting task, and there's also something I really, really want to show off. But, yeah, this guy is not feeling so hot cakes. So let's let's uh, help them out. I guess that's not really what they're saying. I I feel absolutely terrible because apparently I've been too good at predicting what's happening in the story, and people are like, "Wait, why do you only translate half of the stuff they're saying?" Because they understand Japanese, and I'm apparently like really spot on sometimes. I'm just like, dude, I don't think even what I'm talking about. Also, this is the most adorable yokai yet. Just look at it. It's so adorable. What do you dweebs want? Uh, could you stop inspiriting that guy? It says here that hot cakes. Uh, I don't know, it just makes people bloated. I, I don't know. I looked up most of them, but I forgot to look up hot cakes because I couldn't actually find it on Wikipedia. And my mind, Nate. However, we deal with this food in the yokai. I don't know, we can eat it. You should eat an adorable yokai with me? Yes, I would. Well, I mean, I don't want to, but you're causing grief to this person. I also didn't eat breakfast this morning. Oh. Oh, you would do that to me! I'm apparently hiding madness! Really? I mean, you're kind of the antagonist here. I think Nate's in the right. Yeah. You're kind of a jerk, and oh my- Look at the butter just flopping around. He's thinking hilarious. But yeah, the, the the trick to this is you have to just keep being like, Ah, oh, come on, hotcakes! Can't you just surrender so I don't have to beat you up? No! Us hotcakes are a pride and proudful race of yokai. We would never back down from a challenge because we are hotcakes. And, g lady, I'm getting tired of bullcrap. I'm gonna beat you up if you don't sink. <sighs> Cooperate. Hey, lady. Hi, apparently. Oh, okay. Apparently, we're leaving. What? <laughs> well, well, fine. I'll fight you because I'm, I'm cake and I'm hot. Debatable, some would say. Anyways, yeah, we gotta fight hotcakes. I don't know what tribe she is or what she even does, but you know, that's half the fun of Yokai Watch. But we got the charming bonus, and it's an E rank. And apparently, Nick Columbus here is just gonna tear it to pieces because it's a water type. But, um, water attribute, how dare I? But we gotta, like, I really should, like, back up so we can actually see the Yokai we're battling because I realized for some of the shorter ones, when I am, like, super close to them, you can't really see what's happening. But yeah, Nick Columbus. He's just gonna take. It's not even trying, bro. Like seriously, what are you doing? Okay, it's a. Guess it's a restoration type. Either that or it's. Re I really wish some yokai, like, even for their spirit attacks, they didn't use like healing. Like, I wish there were some yokai that could heal, but also do damage or some crap like that. Cause I don't know. I feel like restoration types are really good in this game. But at the same time, they're kind of always gonna be low on offense. Like no matter what, even if you have some of the S ranks in. Fine. I'll join you! Cool! Even though I'm never gonna use you, you stinking pancake! But, sure. Give me your medal, huh? That'd be great. But you're so rude! Okay. Well, peace out. Nate, when will you realize your, your, your actions have consequences? That was very mean! Not to mention, I kind of had a crush on her, and you kind of blew that for me. I don't care about your crush, Whisper! I just want the medals to summon the legendaries! Pfft, stupid pancakes. Gosh. Well, it looks like the guy's fine, and... Whoa, I feel less like a pancake. Dude! Huh, how about that? It looks like he's instantly been cured! How about that? Yeah. Well, I hope I can find that yokai a little bit later, because I really want it. I don't know why. Some of my favorites are like D and E ranks just because they're so st It's weird. I, I, I'm just like My favorite yokai are the really weak useless ones and the really ridiculously overpowered ones It's never in the middle man like honestly 
I want to keep the steam for the rest of the game. No, not really. That's probably going to be really dumb. But I kind of want to do keep shooting Doji. All right, so let's see what we got. We got, we got... Oh my gosh, I'm going to get a gold. I know it. Oh my gosh, I was so close, dude. I was only like 17 spaces away from getting the gold. Okay, so one quest down. Crud, I really want to do some more dream roulette. All right, we might do that at the end of the episode if I have time. Uh, what should we do next? Okay. There are a couple of quests, and I think I actually need to do this one, and... You'll see, I'll be the best ever. I'll be the next Madonna. But doesn't Madonna do music, not model? Uh, whatever, this lady's obviously been spirited by this guy. <laughs> this is like the weirdest yokai I've seen yet. Like, I, I kind of get what this is a reference to, but at the same time, I don't. He's like a devil that's also a reporter. Nah, pictures of Spider-Man. Yeah, I can get you those. All right, so we need pictures of Spider-Man battling Doc Ock. Can you get that? Doc Ock? I haven't seen that movie yet. You haven't seen Spider-Man 2? It's like, uh... All right, whatever. It says here that this yokai inspirits people to always be very blunt, as if they're doing interviews. I don't really know. That seems oddly specific, even for a yokai. It's my one and only job, kid. Calm down. So, yeah, this guy, um... He ha he's called the Atta Atta Times or something like that, because it's like a chat. He's like the yokai that needs the localization the most, in my opinion, but uh, I guess he wants to interview us, and I've never done an interview. Well, it's time to have you first. You ready, kid? I guess. All right, all right. What's your favorite type of mashed potato? There are different kinds. Don't don't tell me you don't got a different one, because there, there's like mashed potatoes, butter potatoes, thinking lemon potatoes, cheese potatoes. <laughs> Wait, are cheese potatoes even real? I don't even know. But yeah, bro, what's up? Gonna get in spirit me, I guess. And all right, here's your interview. Nate? All right, uh... <laughs> And I don't know for whatever reason we really don't need to track this, but this is like the weirdest segment ever. So basically, wait, where the crud he go? Crap, did I lose him? I did. Okay, no, I think crud. I forgot what to do. Luckily, you can go into the quest menu and then get all the tracking you need. But uh, yeah. So apparently, we have to literally just go over here and talk to this dude, and wow, the FPS on your hand moving is so low, because there's probably like a million sprites on the screen. Anyways, what's up, dog? Okay, now you're ready for your Spider-Man interview. Apparently, I'm talking like Butch from Pokemon. I don't really know why, and... Alright, I guess we're getting re-inspirited, and <laughs> oh yeah, Spider-Man, I know that guy. Oh really? You got the good scoop on him? How's he act in real life? Uh, so keep picking the bottom option, and well, some people call him a hero, but I think of him more as a nerd. Honestly, who wears a costume and swings around New York like that? That's so overdone. Batman Munch? <laughs> Come on. But I like him. Marvel's pretty cool. I still think so anyways. <laughs> as if. DC's the best, and we all know it. <laughs> like, seriously, a Spider-Man? Talk about a Mega Man ripoff. That's not even correlated. What are you talking of? <sighs> Nate, you're kind of being stupid, don't you think? No, no, this is hot stuff. This will go great for editorial. Uh, newspapers still do that, right? I don't really know. All right, so bottom option again. Now that I think about it, you know who's even a bigger ripoff than Mega Man? That guy named Metroid. What's his deal? Ripoff munch? Yeah, yeah, he's terrible, isn't he? He can turn into a ball. That's a ripoff of, uh, I don't know, <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> oh, man, it felt great to get all those opinions off my chest. But, uh, what else do you want to hear about? We are talking about potatoes or some crap earlier. Oh, was he ever? Yeah, what do you think of potatoes? You think Spider-Man likes potatoes? Come on, let me know what you think. Wait, how is that relevant to Spider-Man? I don't really know, and... Now that you mention it, I did see Spider-Man eating a lot of potatoes one day. Like, seriously, a high-carb diet at his age? Pfft, come on. He's gotta start looking out for his health. Kind of immature, if you ask me. And at the end of the day, I mean, we're all free, but seriously, he's setting a poor example for everybody. Hmm, that's just my opinion, though. That is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Anyways, that's, that's, uh, that's good info, kid, but, uh... Okay, yo, bro, I don't got all day for you, man. All right, we're good. Thank goodness. So, yeah, just keep picking the bottom option, and you're fine. 
I'm pretty sure. And uh, now we pick the first one, and we should be done here. I think. Oh my gosh, dude, I ain't got time for you, bro. Nate, what the heck? I'm pretty sure we... Yeah, now we gotta battle him. I was about to say, because I think you can fail that, and you have to sing and re-answer him. But yeah, he's of the Shady Tribe, and he don't stink and got nothing on my cat. Because my cat is water, and he... Holy crud, that hurt. Yeah, he's weak to ice. We don't have any ice attributes yet, but once we get them... I think we'll have pretty much all the main elements except for Earth, and... To be honest, I kind of just want to use water attribute Yokai, and what the heck? He's weak to ice, but can drain? Is that new? Is it? Because I know there are yokai in this game that have no weakness. And they're drain attributes. I don't know. That was kind of odd. And yeah, we beat him before the first wisp even showed up. Holy crud. I guess our uh, Legion of Fire yokai really... They were doing good. You know, they were doing good. If we get one more mysterious yokai too, we get the unity bonus for them, which would be great. But I don't really have my sights set on anybody. Hmm. That was kind of easy. Honestly. Seriously. What are you thinking? You're almost as bad as Spider-Man. Nate, that's kind of a weird insult. Yeah, all right, all right. I've seen enough here. You know what? I like you, kid. Get me some more pictures of Spider-Man, and I'll add you to the Daily Bugle. Wait, wasn't is that? Sp what? Yeah, I was about to say, isn't that like saying Daily Bugle is super? What am I talking about? We got Atatata Times. I'm not gonna nickname him because he looks stinking creepy. And honestly. I don't like the press. Just kidding. I did that in high school. And all right, at a at a times. <laughs> Legend my medallion. But don't think you're ever coming out of there. Oh wow, that uh, that kind of stinks, man. You know, I, my 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 leg doesn't even work. You're kind of being a jerk. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I may. I, oh my. God. But you know what? He was even a bigger jerk. That guy Jabanyan. He's kind of vain, don't you think? He has like what? 37 forms now? Isn't that a little mo All right, now you you're seriously just a problem and a nuisance. I really don't. I just dislike you in general. Seriously, stop. I agree, Nate. Japanyon is a friendly cat that everyone loves. Except for me. That's kind of my thing. All right, yo. Are we done here? Wait, what the heck is the whisper looking at? Oh. You know what? Now I'm starting to realize being an idol slash supermodel slash comedian is kind of a lot of work. And I'm kind of lazy. Yeah, I know you are. Well, I'm glad you snapped out of it. <laughs> yeah, that would have been terrible. Where'd that come from? Probably a yoke. I mean, it looks like we did it, Nate. Yay! Yeah, so now there's less yokai inspiriting people. And by the way, Nate, you ever get that in yokai off your dad uninspirited? Yeah, is he? <laughs> He's still inspirited? Nate's dad is still inspirited by the guy, like, with the stakes, bro. What the heck's going on with that? Like, are we gonna ever resolve that? Or it's like, nah, dads are always inspirited to make stakes here in America. I guess. I don't think I know. Always seems like the case. And dang, we're so close to the next level. Well, I'll get that eventually. Or maybe I won't. Maybe all my yokai will turn into stinking space. Dust. That's a thing. Yo, thanks for the... God, I don't even know what the heck those are. And lastly, the uh, last quest I recommend you do is this one. It's gonna give you a super powerful yokai, at least at this stage of the game. So if you're unlucky with a Krankakai, do this one. It is with this girl who can't talk. Uh, hello there. Um, how's it going? Oh, the silent treatment, huh? Uh, hi, my name's Nate. Uh, do you have a request for us? <laughs> oh, it's writing something, I think. Hmm, seems to be writing on its notepad. What is it doing that? Wait, it says right here that yes, I'm the one that wrote the... <laughs> Whisper's just like, dude! Like, <laughs> what is this problem? Wait, I'm forced to read this no matter what? Yeah. That's creepy! So this yokai can't talk and you're forced to talk for it? It appears that's the case. Although it says in the yokai pad that, uh, this is... Dang, I forgot her name. Dude, I swear, I look all these yokai up, but they're super Japanese, and I forget them, because I'm stinking dumb as dirt, and it says its name's not really important. Can we do the quest or not? And if we can't, then we better buzz off. Wow, that's very rude. I mean, uh, it's actually kind of important that you do this request, okay? So do it. My goodness, reading from a teleprompter is bad, but this is demeaning. Well, I don't really care. Let's get to that quest. Okay, okay. It says on the yokai pad that... Nate, I don't want to read the yokai pad anymore. 
We're not. I kind of want that notepad. <laughs> it says, why use a normal yokai pad when you could use this awesome, totally rad notepad from Sayach? I don't really remember her name. But yeah, she's a really one-dimensional yokai. And she wants us, I think, to get stronger to help people out. I think that's what's happening here. Don't really know. But you know what? 100 EXP is fine by me. So let's get to it. Oh yeah, it was Kampechan. It's like a pun on, comp like, the word for composition book. I'm not going to nickname her, because honestly, I don't give a dump. So, added my medallion. Yeah, I guess she's like a Japanese. See, it's so, it's kind of inconsistent. I don't really get it. Because this totally looks like an American yokai, right? But she has, like, the green metal to signify she's from, you know, Japan. So I don't really get that. I mean, she could be a sneaking American yokai. I don't really get that. But yeah, I don't need the tracker for this because I know exactly where I'm going. Basically, now we need to head to the eastern part of St. Peanutsburg so we can talk to a priest. Yeah, kind of weird. In the previous chapter, you may have seen that there's actually a church in this game. Yeah, this is kind of crazy. I guess this is the Shoten Temple of America. And wow, it's really quiet here. Yo, what up, dog? How's it going? Hey, how's it going, man? I'm Kermit the Frog. What can I help you with? Uh, a, a weird yokai told me it wanted to become infinitely powerful. Can you help me with that? Well, I guess so. I mean, it's kind of all we do here, really. Kind of just fuse spiritual beings together and, you know, make them stronger. So, yeah, just get the other half of the fusion. You should be good to go. How's that sound? Well, hey, that's great. Thanks, mister. No problem. Also, uh, do you want to buy my book? It's called a night he's being green. Mm. Uh, no thank you, I'm good. Okay then. Well yeah, just get that yokai and you should be good. Alright, peace out. Don't forget, it's uh, the, pa the parent- Alright, I'm gonna be totally honest, the game calls this the barbecue garden. And it took me literally two hours to how where the dump this is in the game. And I also forgot to do the Kermit voice. And Alright man, good luck. And don't forget to bring a bunch of sweets. They help recruiting the yokai. Okay, cool. Bro, shut up. I gotta go. I gotta go and get the yokai. Okay, peace out. So, I'm gonna direct you to exactly where this is because honestly, the, the, it does not show you anywhere. Also, the KK brothers are over here. Don't worry. They're adorable. I'm gonna get them eventually. But yeah, when you continue their quest line, but uh, yeah. Now I'm gonna show you exactly where this location is. And the smart thing would be to either recruit Cupostal, who can be, like, very easily gotten by just looking under, like, you know. I think they're under cars near Nate's house. At least that's where I saw one, like, during off-screen battling. But, uh, right over here, like, j what the heck? Oh, I thought it was, like, an invisible fence. That was weird. But, yeah, right... I guess it's not really right behind, but sort of near the box guy's house. If you follow this path, like, kind of, it should, yeah, it's right here. This little segment will take you to the barbecue garden. So basically, the yokai we're after is this little dude. It looks absolutely terrifying, but it's required for what we're trying to do here. And oh, there's pancake. Oh All right, so, um, we need to pin it. And I don't have any sweets because I think I'm an idiot. Yes, I am. Holy crud, I am. Um, I guess the closest thing to sweets is like potato chips, so I guess we'll try that. But yeah, we need to get this yokai befriended. No, those are peanuts. God. Oh, maybe we'll like it. But uh, we need to recruit this yokai to finish the fusion. So basically, just hope you get lucky. It's a, it's, it's an okay yokai. It does, it does have a future actually, but I can't say if that evolution's strong or not, because honestly, I don't stinking know. It just seems kind of scary, and I don't like it. But you know what? Hey, a lot of things in life are scary, and holy crud, I didn't get it. All right. Luckily for us, though, this is basically a dungeon, and you can counter, like, a ton of them here. So I'm going to take a little bit of time, battle this thing, and hopefully I'll recruit it. And what the... That, you are not what I'm looking for. Okay, I'm a bit curious. I could have sworn that's what we were battling, and okay. It's weak. So I'm guessing that's in Thunder Attribute Yokai? Because it's weak to uh, ground and stuff, but that's very odd. And the, and the pancake is. The hot cake isn't looking so hot. How about that? Alright, so I guess this Yokai's back here too, now that we have the D rank Yokai watch. But yeah, I really need to capture that Yokai. So, I'm gonna go do that once we 
lose to this really creepy doll. Holy crud. I never realized how many, like, things in America could be considered yokai. Now I'm thinking about it. There's a million ghost tales with scary g dolls. And I don't like that. And we didn't get the yokai. Well, how about... Not that I wanted it, but yeah. Let me try and recruit this thing real quick. Luckily for us, it is ridiculously easy to obtain. You can also battle two of them at the same time, so that makes that great. Yo, what's up, tentacle furball dude? How's it going? You had a good Saturday? Saturday didn't happen yet in your world? Well, how about that? Yo, what up, dog? Join my team. Karamizo. All right, your voice is adorable, but your metal is actually disturbing. Holy crud. Uh, I would nickname you, but you are not going to be in existence for much longer. What's high? Oh, it's an eerie tribe. That's cool. I don't really never gonna use you, but yeah now that we got this it's time to head back to the church And Okay, I probably shouldn't be that loud inside here anyways now that we got both the yokai Kermit the frog Can fuse them together to create its ultimate form and oh I see you got a uh, The notepad one and the other scary one. It's looking good looking good now We're gonna combine these two spiritual beings to make it a divine entity is that what you're calling them nowadays? <laughs> this guy, Nate, I can't believe him. Anyways, let's fuse him up! Oh, got something to say? Of course you do! You're a yokai! And as we know, they never, like, talking and... Never stop talking. Well, I guess Babylon. There's a couple ones that talk. Anyways, fusing's pretty much the same as in Yokai 1. It's pretty cool. I like it. You should try it. Oh, you're about to? Well, how about that? Anyways. <laughs> that is a terrible Kermit the Froggy prey. All right. So let's fuse these two together. So I'm going to be totally honest with you. The reason This isn't the easiest mission to complete, but it's very straightforward if you're watching this video. And oh, snap. We, we can bump, combine to socks? Well, I don't want to do that. It's stinking adorable. All right. So we're going to combine this creepy thing and this creepy thing to make... <gasps> I have no idea, but something tells me it's gonna be intense! Mm. Oh, it's a little girl. Never mind. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? How do you combine this giant hair monster to cre- Whatever. I I'm done questioning Yokai Watch. But yeah, let's nickname this thing. So apparently this yokai is called Mucha Burrico. Well, that is way too Japanese, so we're just gonna call it Burrico. And if you got a problem with that, I don't give a damn. But yeah, here's the great thing about this yokai that is so girly, it's about to drive me crazy. It is not only a charming attribute yo tribe yokai. I didn't say something stupid. It is also a restoration type, which is fantastic. And yeah, now that we got it, I kind of want to put it on my team. I'm not going to lie. So far, Nate has a lot of pretty... Yokai, and that's where you go to save, John. Are you even human? How could one person be this bad? Yokai, watch, it's such an easy game. All right, so let's find her. Uh, so we got this dude, he's C rank, but yeah. Mucho Brico is B rank, and I can't believe it's actually level one. That's actually kind of a bummer, so I guess I'll have to do a little bit of training, but I don't see a reason to use Hamori anymore. We got this yokai. It's way higher rank. It stats like at the end of the game are going to be a lot stronger. If it actually can heal. I think this thing is going to be a great addition to the team. Even though <laughs> it's just, just a girl with like pigtail. I don't really get that. But yeah, now that we got it, we kind of have to go back to the circus. And alright, Mucha Barico, You like your new form and oh my gosh, this is the greatest thing ever, guys. Wait, why'd your voice change? Well, I finally got the courage to start talking! And you know what that means? I can start flirting with boy, okay? Hey, is your friend, uh, Shuten Doji single? Or how about Karesu Tengu? They are taken by me! Not really, but why on earth are you all of a sudden like this? I guess it's what she does now. Yeah, I actually figured out on the way here. The limited Japanese I do know. Her name seems some, something like Hopelessly Flirt. I don't really... I don't really know what that's about, but you know what? Hey, cool. We got her on our team now. And hopefully she won't die in a single hit. Oh, wow, she's already level 4. Well, that makes things a little bit easier for me. And also, wow, I really should get around to selling all these, like, bronze dolls and silver dolls I got. And okay, come on. Serious life. Serious life. Come on. Serious life. Se... Se... Ser Oh my gosh, are you trolling? So I thought I was actually gonna get it. God dang it. 
Okay, whatever. We got the story unlocked, so now we can progress. And, hey! How'd you get in here without a ticket? That's illegal! Well, you know what? I like you. You're zealous. You want a ticket? Two for free! Wow, that's convenient. Thanks, bro! Oh, don't mention it. Seriously, don't mention it. I got fired. <laughs> Anyways, that was just a joke. It's not. Seriously, don't mention it. Uh, make up your mind, dude! No, no, I don't think I will. Anyways, here's your free tickets! Share it with a friend. Don't sell it on eBay. I've seen people do that. It's really rude. It actually is. Anyways, yeah, yo, thanks for the ticket, bro. I didn't even know you are gonna give me that, but thanks. I like how, uh... <laughs> <laughs> or Yoka's just chilling in the back. But yeah, I don't know if you guys want me to use her or not. I'm feeling it, though. She seems pretty darn cool. Don't know how useful she's going to be or what her ultimate is. But I guess we'll figure that in the next episode. But before I give the tickets to Mac, you know what time it is, guys. You know what time it is. You know what time it is? You know where I'm stinking running to? Seriously, I mean, it's literally all I like about this game. Okay, not all I like about this game, but literally. I love the fact that, like, a toy series is integrated into Yokai Watch. But yes, we're gonna do the Dream Roulette! And hopefully we get a small amount of roulettes. Because I want to be here all day. The game's gonna auto-save and ruin my life. All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow in the dart before we toss it out, so... I got a 10. I got a perfect 10. I got a perfect 10. I got a 3. Dang it. I hate my... Wait, I got a 7? Holy crud! Yo! Okay, I'm, I'm cool with that. So, let's do rapid-fire coins. I don't know how many coins I got. We got, like, five. Wow, I can't even use all the ones I got. So, for this option, we could get, uh, a Kappa, a Shard of Evil now. I guess that changed. Uh, we got the Tempura coins still. Cool, cool. And we got this. I'm gonna use this, because I really want that Robo Noko, and that looks really cool. The chances, I guess, of getting it, though, are next to none. And it looks like I'm not getting it. Well, how about that corn cheese salad? Don't give me a white. Don't... Are you trolling? Are you trolling? I mean, I know the chances were low already. Okay, I hope that's a yokai that's not exclusive. Ah, oh, dang it. I really wish I scanned better coins than this. Alright, we'll try the- we'll try the blue. We'll try the blue. Why the heck not? There's like a very- oh my gosh. I could've got it! Barely. Okay, double whites? Are you kidding me? Dude, come on! Okay, that's actually a good book. I need to give that to somebody. Alright, so we got three tempura coins. Let's try them out. Really high chance to get a rare yokai here. There's only reds and golds, and if you're all curious, you get one of these coins no matter what when you buy the game. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? This is the worst luck ever. Bruh, I got grape in yon. Yo, what up? How, how you doing? You, got, you like grapes? I like grapes. I like juicy juice. That's my favorite. Dude, honestly, same. Like, Japanese words... Same. Anyways, I'm not using you, because honestly, it's Grape and Yawn, guys. It'd be way too powerful to unleash in this playthrough. Let's put another coin in. Maybe we'll get something good. I swear, if I don't, I'm going to pull out uh, my nostril hairs. No, I'm not going to do that, because that would actually hurt a lot. I swear. No, no, no. Give me, give me go. What on earth is happening? I'm so upset, dude. I'm so upset. Saf and Yawn, what's up? I really wish I'd get you in Yokai Watch 1, but I don't have the coins yet. What up? Safinyum! Holy crud, your voice is so weird. I thought it'd be Safinyon, not Safinyon! Like a stinking samurai, dude. Leave that to stinking. Oh, I didn't have you yet? Dude, alright, yo, that's actually pretty cool. But, uh, our last coin. Is it gonna be something good? I'm hoping for a golden capsule and not Karesu Tengu. That would be great if I, if I, if I got that. I'd be happy. Honestly, at this point, though, any golden castle would be just dandy. Gimme, give gimme give gold. Gimme. Thank you all so much for watching this episode of... Oh my gosh, dude, this is the worst Krankakai ever! Grapinion! Yeah, that's its, that's its voice. Don't, don't lie to me. Alright. I apologize for that. That was absolutely terrible. I didn't even think I'd get that. Uh, dude, I... Uh, how do you even recover from that, man? Not only did I get two gray capsules back to back, but I got a duplicate. Okay, I'm done complaining about it. Guys, thank you all so much for watching. In the next video, we continue with chapter four and test out our new yokai that we got in this video. Wait, we only got one crap. Well, how about that? Anyways, see you guys in the next video. Bye.